we don't know what it is, and we are glad. We don't know where it came from, and we are glad. We don't know where it went, but we are glad. Welcome to Night Vale. Great news today, listeners. Night Vale Community Radio is getting a new, building-wide operating system. StrexCorp has lifted the ban on computers in Night Vale, and we will finally be able to operate all of the electronics in our studio that have been lying unused for what may be decades. We will be digitizing what records we managed to save from last week's fire so that we won't lose years of work to rampant physical processes that spring up randomly across town from nowhere, as well as saving our current broadcasts to the system. The new operating system is being provided, installed, and maintained by Aperture Laboratories. It's called, and let me check my notes on this, the Calibrated Radio Line Operating System. I'm not certain what that means in any sense, But it will be ours, and it will be helpful. It is progress. It is change. Good change. Unlike all of that bad change that you've seen before. Good change. Progress. Computers. Not like that evil computer the old city council got for Megan. A good computer. Provided by Aperture Laboratories, who are completely trustworthy. They're very good at computers. Good computers. Good change. Progress. I'm not worried. I'm sure it will be fine. Just fine. And now, the community calendar. Look upon the face of death. Look closely for it will not be long before you will see him again. Look upon his face, paper white, smiling, smiling, smiling. Look upon his obsidian eyes, smiling, smiling, smiling. Look upon him. Memorize him and know your own future. Breathe the dust that runs through your fingers and know your own future. Weep for the words unsaid, the things undone, and know your own future. Fall to your knees. Beg. Plead. Cry. Beg forgiveness. Plead forgiveness. Cry forgiveness. Forgive. Forget. Forget, 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 forget. This has been the community calendar. Some folks from Aperture dropped by to start the lengthy process of installing our new operating system. One of them, unfortunately, fell into the bottomless pit in the intern break room, even though I told him not to go in there. Scientists, right? On the other hand, the others brought some tuna treats for Koshik and the kittens, so I guess they're not so bad. They said the hardware and software installation would take about a week or so, but that after that there shouldn't be any problems and the new operating system will be good to go. They were also good enough to take Leslie the intern's body out of the booth. That was really nice of them. I kept forgetting, and it was really starting to smell weird. They said they could find a scientific use for it. Good old Leslie. Still doing good work even while having been dead for over a week. I bet his... her? Parents are proud. 
I know I would be if pride were one of the sanctioned emotions. The best I can do right now is ebullient, which is kind of close. Just know that I would be proud if I could. It's all right that I'm not. I'm not complaining. I can't complain. Everything is fine. At any rate, the Aperture guys are busy hooking everything up, and I have to say it's nice to see the station busy again. Daniel and Lauren never came back, unfortunately. I guess they must have assumed the radio station burned to the ground and decided to seek gainful employment elsewhere. Oh well. I can't blame them. Blame isn't sanctioned either. But even if I could, I wouldn't. Their actions seem compassionate and reasonable, and the new station manager is very nice and brings us donuts. Even the cream-filled ones. Those are my favorites. I'm very happy with the way things turned out. And now, a word from our sponsors. Neil. Listeners, we have a very special guest with us in the studio today. My radio counterpart from Desert Bluffs, Kevin Grant. Kevin, welcome to the show. Thanks, Cecil. I am just pleased as punch to be here. So, Kevin, how are you liking Night Vale so far? Oh, it's beautiful, Cecil. I can't believe I've never visited before. I love the quaint little streets, the charming shops, even your, uh, very, very dry radio station. And streets. And, well, everything. It's just so dry here, you know? Very different from home. But beautiful. Strexcorp says it's beautiful. Don't you agree, Cecil? <laughs> oh, yes, Kevin. Night Vale is beautiful indeed. Maybe someday soon I can visit your show in Desert Bluffs. Oh, Cecil, would you? That would be amazing. You and I are so much alike, I'm sure it would be just delightful. I'm sure it would be. I look forward to it. But, Kevin, you've been living with Strexcorp over there in Desert Bluffs for years now. What can we here in Night Vale expect in our future? Oh, <laughs> Cecil, you are a silly one. If I told you what was going to happen, where would the fun be? Some things are better when they're surprises, like birthday parties or corporate takeovers. Well, that is true. And surprise parties are really neat. Yes, exactly. But what I can tell you, Cecil, is that things are going to be even better than they are now. Just wait. Maybe even someday you can have a desk as nice as mine. Uh, yeah. Maybe. I, I like my desk how it is, though. Call it old-fashioned charm. Unite Valians and your old-fashioned charm. I love it. But if Strexcorp replaces the desk, you know you won't be able to complain. Well, no, no, of course not. I wouldn't dream of it. Just, I like my desk, bloodless though it may be. Well, Cecil, you sound so worried. Don't worry. Be happy. <laughs> of course, Kevin, thank you. Sorry, sometimes I just get caught up in little unimportant things. Sure, Cecil, we all do. Which is why it's good to remember to take some time to just relax. Go to sleep. Right, right. But Kevin, tell me, is your station getting a new operating system, courtesy of Aperture Laboratories? Well, no, it isn't. Why, is yours? Yes, actually, it's being installed a week from today. Oh, Cecil, now I'm jealous. And now I'm not. Mood regulation is really on point today, huh? I'm really happy for you, Cecil. A brand new operating system for the station? It sounds wonderful. Maybe you can talk to your bosses about getting one for Desert Bluffs Community oh, Radio. No, I wouldn't dream of it. We don't ask for things, Cecil. We just take them as they come. If station management sees fit to provide us with a new operating system, that's great. And if not, that's great too. Everything's great. You ever noticed that? Kevin, I don't mean to be rude, but could you hold that a little farther from my face? It's making me nervous. Oh, I'm sorry, Cecil. I didn't realize. Sometimes the time is just right to be holding a switchblade. You ever noticed that? They're very pretty. Elegant. Old-fashioned. Unite Valians should love them. Yeah, I'm sure. Well, Kevin, thanks so much for joining us today. It was my pleasure, Cecil. And hey, if you get the chance, I'd love to have you on the show over in Desert Bluffs. You could learn a thing or two about radio broadcasting from someone who's been in the business, 
if I may say so, a lot longer than you have. Sure, Kevin, sure. Cecil, is there something wrong? You're not smiling. What? No, no, everything's fine, Kevin. I was just getting ready to send the listeners to the weather. You're not smiling, Cecil. I don't see how that's- You're not smiling, Cecil. Uh, Kevin? What are you- You have to smile, Cecil. You have to smile for the folks at home. We're on the radio, Kevin. They can't see us. Put put that down, Kevin. Kevin, come on. It's a nice switchblade, okay? It's very pretty. I like it. But please- Don't be afraid, Cecil. Pain is just an emotion that the body feels. Fear and pain are not sanctioned by Strexcorp. You have to smile. You have to smile! Kevin, no, please. I'm smiling. I'm smiling.
Another day, another broadcast, another microcosm of time gone by. Where did it go? We don't know. We can't know. And that's all right. That's just fine. Everything is fine. Kevin went home. Did you know that pain is just an emotion that the body feels? Mood regulation regulates your emotions. It never, ever, ever fails. StrexCorp makes sure. Never, ever. Pain is just an emotion and everything is fine. The scientists went home. They said they'd be back to finish installing the system. I miss them. It is very lonely here. No, it is very nice here. Very nice. Very happy. Pain is just an emotion that the body feels. Everything is fine. Mood regulation never fails. Keep smiling. Smiling is good for you. Keep smiling. Keep smiling. Ear to ear. Ear to ear. Grinning ear to ear. Ear to ear. Funny expression. Funny. <laughs> Oh god, oh god, oh god. Mood regulation is going down, listeners. I can feel it. I can feel it falling apart. System crash. Lonely, heartbroken, stupid. All is not sunshine. The unraveling. They sell. They sell. Mood regulation never fails. Pain is just an emotion that the body feels and everything is falling apart. Mood regulation never fails. Believe in a smiling god. Smile. Ear to ear. Ear to ear. Mood regulation is failing. Pain is just... Pain is just... Pain is... Smiling. Help me. Wow. Oof. Something weird happened there, listeners. I have no idea what it was, though. Probably nothing. Probably unimportant. I'm not worried. Worry is not sanctioned by StrexCorp mood regulation. Mood regulation never fails. Stay tuned next for the sounds that the Void makes, picked up by accident by our antenna. They say it's quite beautiful. With that, then, my duties here are discharged, and I may return home to my beautifully empty apartment that is not lonely, not ever. It is exactly how I want it to be. May all things be exactly as you want them to be. They may yet. Good night, Night Vale. Good night. Blue Sky Glow Cloud is a production of the internet. It is written by SJ, that's me, and produced by me as well. The voices of Blue Sky Glow Cloud are also all me. Original music by Disparition and Aperture Science Psychoacoustic Laboratories. Most of it can be found online at disparition.info or disparition.bandcamp.com. Additional musical contributions from Mindful Wrath. Today's weather was Carnival of Rust by Poets of the Fall. More information can be found at poetsofthefall.com. Portal and all related characters, devices, and scenarios belong to Valve. Today's proverb. You did what? Put that back. You don't know where that's been. Don't give me that look. You know what you did.